Hi, my name is Johansson from City Farm. Today we're going to talk about pump system and design. Hopefully this video will serve as a guideline when you design your first hydroponic system. There are many pump system configuration out there. However, today we are going to talk about two of the most common pump system used, aptly named one, the one pump system and the two pump system, which is great for most uh, hobby hydroponic system. The one pump system is good when the lowest point of your grow bed be it horizontal or vertical plane is taller than your nutrient tank. In this configuration, you will usually have an elevated grow bed with your nutrient tanks situated below your grow bed. You would have one pump to pump the water to each grow bed and all the excess water will flow back to the tank by gravity. You would use a two pump system when your nutrient tank is taller than your lowest grow bed. For example, if you are using a large tank or you like to maximize the use of your space, you will need a sump tank to collect all the excess water. This is where the second pump will come in. It will pump the water from the sump tank back into the main tank. At City Farm Malaysia, in our demo farm, we are using a variation of the two pump system. Ideally, you want to turn over your system volume at least once every two hours. For example, if you have 1000 liters of water in your tank and you need to make sure your pump is able to pump 1000 liters at least once every two hours. Submerged pump come in many sizes, therefore choosing the right size is important. Each pump will have their own function chart, typically found in the box or instruction manual. The function chart will look something like this. On the x-axis is the liters per hour, and on the y-axis is the height. Now, in order to calculate uh, the amount of water your pump will be able to pump to your system, uh, you will use this graph. So a typical uh, function chart of the of your pump will look something like so. And for example, if this is 1000 liters at zero meter height, and this is two meters. And if your system is about 1.5 meter height, you are able to map this out. Let's say for example, this is 300 liters. Now, if your tank is 800 liters, this means that it will only be able to pump around 600 liters of water uh, for every two hours. Means that uh, your, your pump is too small and you might need to uh, buy a bigger pump. If the height of your system is around uh, 0.5 meters, so now this will translate to about uh, let's say for example 800 liters per hour now if your tank is 800 liters this means that uh, by the end of two hours you would have recycled your entire um, system volume twice thank you for watching this video click here to view our last video be sure to subscribe to city farm malaysia and get notified when we post new video about vertical farming and hydroponics in general. Also leave your comments in the comment box below on what topics you like us to talk about in the future. Your irrigation tubing hole puncher, your irrigation uh, microtubing joiner, rubber flange, your L-joint, two end caps,